Pradeepan, I wanted to ask you your view on Coal India. But first, let me just tell our viewers about a note that Jefferies put out on Coal India earlier today. They say that they have a buy rating target price of around 520. They believe that this 13% decline that we're seeing in the stock, it's a good buying opportunity. And two big reasons they've given out there. Volume growth, they're expecting it to continue to feed India's rising power demand. And they're working with 8% growth for this year and close to around 6% Kaggle growth for the next couple of years. On Coal India's targets, they're saying for FY24, what they've set out to do around 770, they're pretty much on board. On their FY25 basis, what Coal India has said, well, they are a little bit lower than that 838 million tons. The second point that they are mentioning besides volumes is that there's a big fall in e-auction prices, but they believe it's largely behind. And if you pull up the trajectory, the e-auction premium to FSA prices, that's come down you know, from around 200% to 117%, and for this quarter, it's in that vicinity of around 35 to 50%. Jefferies is working with a 50% premium, and they are saying this is more or less in line with the average that we've seen in the last 10 years or so, which is around 63%. But if it does fall, then that's a risk to the EPS estimates. And the third point they make is, first point is volume, second point is on e-auction prices, third point is on valuations. They're saying it's trading at around 8.3 8 times, which is at a bit of a discount in comparison to its historical averages and a discount in comparison to the Nifty as uh, well, Nifty multiples. And, uh, you know, so that's all the reasons that they've given why they're positive on it.